I could be, <laughs> I could be happier to watch my big sister get married to a guy like Brandon. <laughs> Your character is pure, and I can see how truly happy you make her. It's appropriate we gather here to celebrate such a special occasion because it was here in this church that some nine years ago, this all began. Nowhere else in the universe is there a space like that which you two have created. This is not just a brain in space or just a Meredith space. It's a space that bears all things, a space that is more concerned with we than me, a space that is constantly pouring out, confident that in giving up control you are open to receive divine grace, open to be fully known and loved exactly as you are. This space, this is a sacred space. In seasons of change, be reminded of this moment. This time where you gathered in this church. This time where you gathered in front of God and your friends and family to declare, I am here for you. I have your best interests in the forefront of my mind. And I'm committed to your best and to our best. I, Brandon, take you, Meredith, to be my wife. I, Meredith. Thank you, Brandon, to be my husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. From this day forward. Better for words. For richer for poor. And in sickness, in sickness and in health. And health to love and to cherish. To love and to cherish until we are parted by death. death. This is my soul now. Brandon, Brandon, you have declared your consent and vows before God and this congregation of your family and friends. May God confirm your covenant and fill you both with grace and joy. Brandon, you may kiss your bride. And may I present to you for the very first time, Mr. and Mrs. David Brandon Howard. For all the hair pulling and stress that I caused my sister, it's so nice to know that she has someone as sweet and caring as Brandon to be able to calm her down and remind her how great of a brother I am. <laughs> when I think of the best relationships I've been around in my life, I think my parents, I think my grandparents. You know, constant give and take of love, support, compromise, dedication, and grace. Now when I think of these same kinds of relationships, I have put Meredith and Brandon up there with the best of them. I would just want to say how beautiful this all has been today. I cannot think of anything more special than to have lifelong friends that are going to be together and will be in my life forever. I've known her forever, and I met Brandon, we were in middle school, and ever since then, we were best friends. We became best friends almost immediately, and the day that they met, I knew it was destined that they were gonna be together forever, because they had just this connection that was great. When you asked me to be your maid of honor, I tried to play really cool, but standing next to you today was probably the most exciting day of my life. I'm so thankful that Meredith ended up with someone like Brandon, because I know for the rest of her life that she's going to be happy and protected, and she's going to be loved forever and ever. And I could not ask for anything more than that from you. 
but I will hurt you. <laughs> you better make her cry. I am very proud of them both. I am very proud of Brandon's family, our families. You couldn't ask for a better group of people to represent what Meredith and Brandon are today. And there will be nothing that's going to be there to separate me. I have a happy and fruitful and forever marriage.